I know. I'm not professional at all. But hello everybody. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how to make glow in the dark slime. And this is my first glow in the dark slime. It is great. Um and I'm gonna show you so you guys can believe me that it's actually glow in the dark. So I'm gonna go in my closet and I know you guys are thinking, Allie, that never ends up good. But I'm gonna come in here. You can't see me. Can you see the slime? It's glow in the dark. It's amazing. And it looks better in real life, trust me. Uh, I'm about to drop you guys. Oh, this looks so weird. I know you don't wanna see that part of me, but yeah. So it looks way better in real life, trust me. Um, I made, my brother loved it so much that he made me make him some. That's a big accomplishment. So yeah. Um, so I'm gonna make you, I'm gonna show you how you make this awesome stuff. And it's borax free, and it's great. So yeah, let's get started. All you'll need to start out with is a bowl, a spoon, and some glue. So you don't need this much glue, but put as much glue as you want or need. Okay, that's probably a little too much, but that's okay. Every slime is better when it's big. So you don't need any food coloring for this because this is a glow in the dark slime. I guess you could put some if you want to. But you're just gonna take your glow in the dark paint, which I found at the dollar store. And everybody's like, oh, you can find what so in, whatever this is at the dollar store. But you can and you can't find it. This is actually good at the dollar store. Um I found it at Dollar Lama Dollarama, just to be precise. Um so yeah, and you don't I don't know how much you want. Okay, that's probably good. So then you're just gonna mix that up with your spoon. I guess I don't know how else you'd do it without getting messy. Mix it up so that you don't see any clumps of green. And this looks like normal glue. It doesn't look colored at all. Maybe like a tiny bit. This looks like it'd be really green, but it's not that green, let me tell ya. Okay, just mix that up for a minute. Okay. Looks good. Next, we're gonna take one teaspoon, and I don't know why it's all the way over here, but then you're gonna use some baking soda. So you're just gonna do one teaspoon of baking soda, I don't know how, how, I don't know how to explain it, but it was really hard to get this baking soda open. Just saying, <laughs> took lots of effort. Okay, make sure that's good. And then you're gonna do, um, you're gonna start out with one teaspoon of contact lens solution and you can get this at Walmart. Just start it with that because you don't want to overactivate it. So while I'm um, mixing this, I just want to tell you that my channel, it might not always be slime, but most of it's going to be slime. Um, just saying because, you know. <sighs> it doesn't seem that slimy yet. I'm just going to add like another, almost another teaspoon. Like you want to do it slowly, carefully. It's super stretchy if you don't have to, if you don't activate it too much. Ah, that's so good. Still not clumping together as I'd like it to. Ah, see it's sticky. And then it's sticky. And a little bit. And I'm just saying. Like, contact lens solution runs out so quickly. Oh gosh, this is great. It's starting to really stick together more than the other sides. Okay, so I'm gonna try. Oh, this is giant slime for me. Oh yeah, it's sticky. It's good texture, but it's a little sticky right now. Okay, this 
is just clamping together perfectly. Really good. Yeah. It's still a little tiny bit sticky. Have you ever like made slime for like your brother or sister and then they're like younger than you and they're like, this is sticky when, and you play with it and you're like, oh, this is perfect. And they're like somehow like got it everywhere. Yeah, it happens to me too much. I had to overactivate my younger brother's glow in the dark slime because he thought it was too sticky even though it wasn't sticky at all. <laughs> my gosh. I'm just saying you cannot, the only reason I got glow in the dark slime at the dollar store is because it was in, what this? it was in the Halloween section. If it's not in the Halloween section, it, if your dollar store hasn't gone out for Halloween yet, it's probably not gonna be there. It might, but I'm just saying, the only reason I got mine was it was for the dollar store. And a good craft that I did with my, with my glow in the dark paint, is I made a pumpkin that was glow in the dark. So it was really awesome. So, this is your ending kind of thing. It's really nice. Woo, bubble. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna do a finale swirl. This is giant. I'm a glab. I'm a glab. So big. That was really bad, but and that didn't happen. So thank you guys for watching this. Comment down below um, if you're excited for Halloween as I am. And give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. And also if you want to see a how to make fluffy slime that shaving cream video so yeah thank you for watching this video have a great day and yes and now my professional self has to come over and do this one myself <laughs> so i know this is really close but thank you for watching Bye bye